The price of wine is rocketing as more ordinary Chinese people acquire a taste for good wine. Wine from France's top chateaux have always been popular with drinkers and investors, but growing interest in China has seen special vintages selling at record high prices at auctions. Here's that story. Two years have gone by since the Chateau Marjot's 2009 grape harvest. Now its wine is just ready for bottling. The Bordeaux winemaker, a first growth wine estate, produces one of the best quality wines. Its wines have always been popular with wine connoisseurs and investors. Now prices are soaring because of the Asians' growing taste for good quality wine. According to Sotheby's global head of wine, Asians buy to drink, not to invest. They serve it at meals with friends and they give it as presents. But they have concentrated on what are called the first growths in Bordeaux and also things like the top second growths. And that's where their real concentration has been um, and it has really enhanced that market. Chateau Lafitte's wines are leading the way into the growing Chinese market. Sotheby's Hong Kong auction sold three bottles of the 1869 Lafitte Rothschild for more than $230,000 each at the end of last year. A dozen bottles from 1998 are expected to fetch about $13,000 in October. Records will still be made for very special wines or very special provenance um, when something comes from a very a named famous seller, for instance, or direct from the property. Records will continue to fall. According to a wine expert, now ordinary Chinese, and not just the increasing number of Chinese millionaires, have acquired a taste for wine. There's a big uh, expansion away from the, 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 the first tier cities, Beijing, Shanghai, Guangzhou, and it's moving, moving much further out into, into the secondary tertiary cities where there's, where there's a, a big explosion of wine appreciation. A Beijing resident explains his interests for wine appreciation. Sometimes I can guess where the wine was produced, the type of grape which was used, or the method used to make the wine just through its features. Guessing correctly is very interesting and it's fun. Back in Bordeaux, a wet summer could mean a good harvest for grape growers with wine connoisseurs predicting an exceptionally good year for French wine. Either way, Chinese drinkers will still get a bottle or two.